Hello you beautiful people and welcome back to Let's Play War of 40k Inquisitor Prophecy in another episode with the priority assignment this time. It's a Alpha Legion, Vang Alpha Legion Vanguard which we are fighting against in and it's a data hunt. The subject recidivist um, scheme. Hive, Lucius is the location. Sketchy, Vox transmission from the Imperial Cruiser indicate the Assailants are none other than the traitors from the Alpha Legion. If they manage to gain control over the bridge, they can unleash utter devastation on the planet. Our only chance is to sabotage the cogitation network on the ship. Orders board the ship and upload scrap code to cripple the battery control systems. Intelligence assets report several vulnerable cogitator stations in the area. Exact locations unknown. Tech priests predict moderate hostile presence. Moderate. Just moderate. I don't assume that there's going to be any difference at all. In the different mission types. That is actually the point I did want to make here. So I expect not that heavy of a resistance, considering the last episode, which was, um, well, not that hard. I'm gonna need to be a little bit careful about them snipers, because what we have, if I remember correctly, although the last episode for me is just five minutes ago or three minutes, that, no, actually, I just need to be careful. Didn't happen in the last episode, I think, with our suppression resistance. Once it is down, by, for example, a bloody tarantula. It is quite dicey when a sniper shoots at us and... The knockback is then not a, a little bit painful. I want to say not that painful, but well, the knockback ain't that great. Okay, I don't need to kill him, but I don't want to let him fall in our back. That would be not so cool. Alright, hello buddies. Them. Okay, I might be firing on the wrong persons here on the wrong enemy since well actually I should have started with the bloody tower but with a couple of special skills it is not that hard to take them down cheers to the jump plus Accessing hostile network. data siphon protocols initiated warning enemy response teams nearby prepare for contact Sorry, I needed to look that up, but plus the scatter field, obviously a amazing ability, although we might argue that the scatter field might have been a little bit of a overkill since I thought, I think they were already down. Okay, next group incoming. Very, very weird, right? That the reload is working out when you interact with the cogitator but you need to reload before and not afterwards that is well funny Dynamic the harvested data is secure injecting purge protocols to compromise them. locate notification okay i mean I ain't no pro gamer, right? I never would say that and I mean I put a lot of hours in here but I never brought it to a level well. I mean there I guess there isn't even a competitive scene but whatever. But I never completely call me noob. Just fine for me. But with the tactical view I never completely understood it, at least for the classes I have played since. It is, at least at the levels I play, not n not necessary to, well, stay out of the enemy range. It is just working out like so, right? Mm, 
Okay, we are almost at the next cogitator, of course. Obviously, a couple of enemies are here. Okay, gone they are. Okay, send the next wave. You never know. I would like to know what these warp anomalies actually do. It would be so nice if that would be indicated on, well, s on the sensor somewhere. Because, to be honest, the plus damage one, I would, I think, not take. I would rather have, um, would not pay three uh, inoculators for that. But that is something I guess is not gonna come. And don't get, get me wrong here, I ain't complain. That is really, really no complaint at all. Just something I, well, said without any thoughts behind. Wee, okay, I like critical hits. What I did in the background, I still, as I said, I ain't no programmer, right? I am not so sure. Why was he not stunned? I did invest a little bit more in the AoE spell, in the AoE passive talent tree, so to say, and increased the AoE damage. Don't know whether that is for, whether that has a huge impact on the AoE spell we have. I have the feeling, but obviously I ain't certain. Okay, since we don't want anyone going to our back, I'm first of all gonna take all of the enemies down here. We don't want any of those nasty buggers actually, once we are waiting for the waves to come in, to actually combine and then the Emperor, a demon was bound to the and then be more powerful okay thank you for all of, all of that all right all right all right okay the chest i'm gonna take with me and then one or two more enemies thank you He's down. And then only to the cogitator it goes. What do you do? Harvesting data from compromised network. Warning. Hostile units inbound. What? Okay. Was pressing the wrong button there. Okay, maybe the clearing out of the enemies was not necessary. I think that could be said, but well, we played safe then. Totally acceptable, right? And yes, don't worry, I am obviously gonna pick up them items very, very soon. Right before we exit this. Okay, before we beam out of here, let me... Okay, everything picked up. And out we are. Mm -hmm. 
We have gained control of the flagship in the last minute. The Alpha Legion forces have been purged and the situation has been neutralized. The puzzle is now more or less complete. Heretical elements of the government have created a false report about the number of Cyclists and the populists, populists in an effort to cause violence. The ultimate goal was no doubt the creation of a major warp breach. Luckily that did not happen. It is not yet clear whether the whole thing was con conceived by the Alpha Legion or if they simply seized an opportunity that presented itself. Senior agents of the Inquisitions are now... Did I say Inquisitions? I meant Inquisition, obviously. It would be weird if there would be a multitude of Inquisitions right in the Imperium, except, you know, the different orders are now assigned to the investigation of the aspect and they are also rooting out the remaining heretics in higher echelons of the planetary government and that you guys brings us right now to the end of this episode and you know it i as usual really really thank you for watching if you guys actually do have enjoyed didn't i need to select something there okay there we are oh tactical environmental helmet um enjoyed this episode guys then please give me a little thumbs up and subscribe well where is it man and subscribe and hope Hopefully, and hopefully I see you in the next episode. Until then, have a nice day. Stay frosty. Bye.